I'm here at one of the UK's top private hospitals to find out what it's really like to go private. I've been given full behind the scenes access to BMI's internationally renowned London Independent Hospital. The difference here is that they deal not only with routine cases, but also with high level complex care such as heart and neurosurgery, something rare in the private sector. We'll hear from some of the top UK consultants, as well as staff and patients, about why this hospital is set apart from the rest, and also why it's so important to make the right choice when going private. We're here at the London Independent Imaging Department have invested heavily in the latest equipment, including 1.5 Tesla magnet, 120-slice CT scanner, up-to-date digital mammography, and nuclear medicine scanning department, as well as the usual modalities such as ultrasound and plain x-rays. This is one of the most advanced units in the UK. I'm Thelma, one of the sisters here in the outpatient department, and I've been with the hospital for over five and a half years. Here in the outpatient department, we see an average of 2,000 patients a month, and we're lucky enough to work with some of the top consultants in the country. One real advantage of being part of such a major private hospital is that we're able to work closely with all different departments, like imaging and pathology, to organize tests very quickly and without sending them off site. In fact, we also provide one-stop services for many specialities such as breast health, urology, cardiology and women's health. Another great thing about this outpatients department is that we have a huge number of consultants with regular clinics here so appointments are always possible at short notice. I was diagnosed with a heart murmur by my GP and was able to come in and see Professor Timmis here the next day. Professor Timmis picked up I had more than a heart murmur and the very next day I went for all sorts of tests, MRIs, CTs, etc. What happened was they discovered I had a dissected aorta with three aneurysms and then I needed emergency surgery. As a consequence of which I was rushed into the hospital and operated on to have the issue resolved. What happened was the surgery turned out to be really complicated and this hospital fought for 30 hours to save my life. They succeeded, although I was in a coma for a week and in intensive care for three weeks. During the time I was in the coma, I know the hospital was immensely supportive to my family and I don't think they could have got through it without the support of the people here. They saved my life and they've saved my sanity. We work with top consultants on a daily basis, therefore our standards have to be consistently high. We take as nurses a holistic approach in the way that we deliver care and that means that we have the time and resources to meet the needs of our private patients. Now, there's obviously no doubt about the hospital's excellent clinical care, but what about the rest of the patient experience, like the rooms and the service? Well, there are over 70 private rooms just like this one. If you're a patient at the hospital, this is where you'll come before and after your procedure or any high dependency or intensive care. And the best part is that each room is supported by the hospital's own in-house hotel services department. This is a dedicated team of people who are responsible for ensuring that you experience all of the extra touches you'd expect from going private. All of the rooms are fully equipped with ensuite facilities, a flat screen satellite TV, phone and all the latest electronics for the bed, lighting, nurse call and wireless monitoring. Plus, you even get your own mini fridge. What's more, patients can order room service from the delicious in-room dining menu and their visitors can even join them. And just like in any good hotel, patients here also receive a complimentary daily newspaper and have access to a range of other services such as dry cleaning, mail, religious services, pharmacy and translators. The most important elements of the London Independent are its clinical services and they're able to handle even the most major and complex cases. So let's take a look at their critical care unit and talk to the team there. Having a full critical care unit here means that we can deal with cases at the very highest level of complexity and the main types of patients that we look after in our ITU are those who have come into the hospital for either major heart surgery, neurosurgery, complex orthopaedic surgery, bowel surgery or reconstructive surgery. And we're actually one of the very few private hospitals in the UK to have such advanced facilities and it does help us to attract many of the top specialists because they have that added reassurance. 
But as well as dealing with major and complex surgical cases, the Critical Care Unit provides all of our patients and consultants with a distinct advantage above and beyond many smaller and more local private hospitals. And that's really our ability to offer the highest level of backup for any procedure undertaken at the hospital. I'm Colin Natale. I choose to work at the London Independent Hospital because it provides exceptional care for my patients. I choose London Independent Hospital for all the support it provides me to give an A-class service for my spinal patient. I'm a consultant cardiologist and I choose the London Independent Hospital because its first class cardiac facilities allow me to perform my procedures effectively and safely in all of my patients. I bring my patients to the London Independent Hospital because the catheter lab staff are excellent and look after my patients very, very well. The heart unit at the London Independent really is world class and this sets it apart from almost any other private hospital in the UK. Firstly, it's moved with the times and regular investment means that it is one of the most advanced units of its kind in the private sector, including a recently upgraded £1.6 million cardiac suite. This enables us to carry out a wide range of minimally invasive procedures. Also, having full critical care backup and such an experienced team mean the hospital is able to handle every aspect of the patient pathway, from non-invasive diagnostic tests right up to heart surgery. We're a friendly bunch here in the cardiology department and all of the staff here aim to go the extra mile for patients. And it's this that makes us not just a good hospital, but a great hospital. And that's why patients come from all over the world to be treated by us. Anyone can access treatment at the London Independent and it's a very simple process. There are two main options. If you have private medical insurance then you just need to obtain a referral from your GP. If you don't have insurance and want to pay for yourself, BMI offers straightforward clear pricing. They've even set up specially discounted all-inclusive package prices for many procedures and you won't always need a GP referral. Just call for details or visit the website. Well, we've heard lots of really useful information from the London Independent on what you should expect when going private in a top hospital. And I hope that it's made you more informed when choosing your future healthcare.